Another pleasant January morning. Able to wear a t-shirt. It's a little breezy. I may have to put a shirt on. I don't know. See how much activity I can produce and generate some body heat. I've started on the roof framing, as you can see. Um, it's kind of taken shape. Got my rafters cut, so we will uh, kind of zip through the installation of the rafters now. Stay tuned. The rafters now are all in. Time for some blocking, which I absolutely hate doing, but it has to be done. And then to fill in these gable ends, and I'm ready for a little plywood on this end. Uh, some trim boards up around the fascia. And maybe by tomorrow afternoon, I'd be ready to uh, start putting up some roof sheathing. I hope so. Gabby's after squirrels again. Good morning. I apologize that I haven't recorded much of what's happened uh, since I was doing the uh, roof framing. Progress has been just dreadfully slow, embarrassingly slow actually. Getting this roof plywood up here is almost a little too much for an old man to do alone. But I managed to get it, it just took some time. I started on roofing. I'm using asphalt shingles, uh, the Tamco Heritage. I really like the shingles. They have a pretty good look to them. I wish they were a little heavier so they left a better shadow profile, but uh, I'm happy with the way they are. I'm all set up to do some more shingling. I've pretty much finished the other side, but we'll go ahead and go into time lapse as I uh, as I work on finishing this side up. Enjoy it, stick around, stay with me.
The roofing is done. That makes me happy. It gives me a dry spot to stand inside or sit inside, have a beer, and watch it rain on Monday. My next step is to finish the plywood sheathing on the wall around the front. Then I've got that double door to hang, and I'll feel pretty comfortable about uh, where I stand with this shed. Join me again once I get there. I am joining you on an absolutely gorgeous January morning here in the Ozarks. The temperature is 58 degrees. Last night there was just an absolutely tremendous uh, rainstorm that moved in from the Gulf of Mexico and dropped about an inch of rain. Um, just a real light show for lightning and uh, thunder. It was pretty darn spectacular. Uh, this morning in the valleys, everything is foggy with some rays of sunshine coming through and it, it is just an absolutely beautiful morning. I'm going to close out this episode um, by showing the progress on the shed. I'm, and I'm sorry I didn't record a lot of it. Uh, I was working in rain and uh, I wanted to get this part done. So anyway, um, the doors that I made uh, with the lumber that I sawed on the wood miser are in. They're installed. Um, they seem to be working just great. It's a double door to where I can drive something as big as uh, eight feet wide into it. So we'll open up the doors, take a quick look at that. I gave the floor one more coat of epoxy paint um, just so that it is well protected. And I actually changed my mind and wanted something a little darker that didn't show the dirt quite as bad because I'll be keeping things like lawnmowers and uh, gas powered equipment in here. And then this one here I've got locked down with uh, uh, surface bolts on the bottom and top, so it's pretty solid that it'll open to. Added a hasp for a little bit of security. If you enjoyed this episode, please give me the thumbs up. Uh, I'm okay with the thumbs down too if you didn't like it. Uh, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, leave some comments. I really enjoy reading your comments. And please share with a friend. I, uh, I would love to see this go a little further than just the couple of people who have watched it so far. So stay tuned for the next episode. And uh, until then, have a great time.